The movies are out early for the holiday weekend, and movie critic Kevin Carr from FatGuysAtTheMovies.com gives us his advice. See it, rent it, or skip it. Now, Kevin, hey, thanks for being with us Thank on a Thanksgiving so morning. Brought some kids in there, too. Brought your family. That's very nice. Yep. Making a family affair. Talking about some family movies, actually. Fantastic Mr. Fox is out. It's mm -hmm. animated, of course. What's the uh, story on this? Well, this is based on Roald Dahl's classic book, and it's about a fox that uh, is trying to relive his days as a, as a chicken thief after settling down with a family, and so he starts stealing food from some farmers and they're really mean farmers and they go after him <laughs> and he has to go underground and hide with all the other woodland creatures this is a really quirky weird movie it's directed by Wes Anderson who did movies like uh, the, the Life Aquatic and the Royal Tenenbaums really and it's a perfect blend of Anderson and Dahl's work it, it's stop motion animation which reminds me of the animation you saw in like the old Rudolph the Red yeah, right. Reindeer shows and it's just a brilliantly done movie it's quirky it's fun my kids loved it and uh, uh, you know, it's really it's one are. of the most quotable things I've seen in a long time. I really enjoyed this movie. A lot of voices we're going to recognize in this too, right? Oh yeah, George Clooney, Meryl Streep, Bill Murray. It's it's loaded up with people, and and it's just it's a fun movie and a really good kind of just enjoyable film for the family. Excellent. This is one I'm looking you forward really to see are. too. Now another one that's kind of being pitched as a family friendly film: Old Dogs with Robin Williams and John Travolta. What's the deal on this? Well, it's directed by the guy who did Wild Hogs, mm -hmm. and and I figure they're just doing the rhyming thing. And his <laughs> next movie will be about frogs. Maybe yeah, right. Maybe. You know, uh, he's trying to recapture lightning in a bottle, which he did with Wild Hogs, which I kind of thought was fun. But but part of the thing that helped that one is it had a great cast. This one has Robin Williams and John Travolta as uh, aging marketing executives. One of them finds out that he has kids and has to take care of them for a couple weeks. And it really is forced. I, I, I really didn't think it, it worked that well. And the chemistry between Travolta and Williams isn't that great. Really? It's very random. It has its moments. It has some good slapstick comedy, and my kids did enjoy it. Yeah. But, uh, you know, for me, it was, you know, it, it, it just didn't have the magic that the Wild the Hogs wild had. Hogs part did. of it, yeah. Part of it, they had a great cast with that one. They just have two. So, uh, this one, to me, is a skip it. A skip it. All right, excellent. And uh, let's talk about this last one here, Ninja Assassin. Mm -hmm. This one doesn't exactly look like a family-friendly fair here, does it? No, I take, I keep the kids home for this one. It's R-rated, and very much uh, deservedly so. Yeah. It's, it's, well, you know, it's exactly what it's about. It's about a ninja who's an assassin, and he <laughs> goes rogue, and then the other ninjas come after him, and it's, well, I'm not worried about the story. It's just a big, bloody, crazy, you know, destruction and, and and they have you know ninjas attacking other people with blades it's very very bloody a lot of cgi blood very violent but a lot of fun i watched this movie because I, i've seen a bunch of other movies that that are sort of like some award films yeah. some family films so when i saw this one i was like this is great this is awesome action and a lot of fun it's directed by the guy who did v for vendetta so i enjoyed it uh, uh, so I, see it sent, see it rent it or skip it see it if you got a strong stomach but don't bring the kids <laughs> all right excellent kevin carr interesting stuff today well, uh, fantastic mr fox was see it mm -hmm. um uh, wild hog no not wild hogs uh, uh old, dogs. old dogs what's the difference right yeah. <laughs> old dogs was a skip it mm -hmm. and uh, this one was a see it yep great thanks for being with us. Thank you very much. Happy Thanksgiving. You too.